Now today we are going to look at a very important concept in the case of waves and that is the relationship between the wave speed, the lambda which is the wavelength and the frequency. So this is the relation wave speed is equal to lambda the wavelength multiplied by frequency. So frequency is the number of uh, times uh, the wave pattern would repeat in one second that is the frequency. Lambda is the wavelength. The wavelength is the distance between uh, on the wave between the two points after which the wave pattern would actually repeat. So this is the lambda distance from here to here. This is lambda. Okay. And you can measure the lambda the wavelength by looking at the two tops, the two crests of the wave or two troughs, two bottoms of the wave. Okay. And all of those will give you this uh, the wavelength. Uh, now the formula here is V is equal to lambda F and we should always remember this formula. So here we will try to give you some intuition so that it becomes easy for you to remember the formula. Now here what we have this one let's say that we have a source of the wave here. So wave is being generated here and in one second how many such waves are generated F. So what is the distance from here to here in one second these many waves were generated. So what is the distance from here to here? The distance from here to here is actually equal to lambda which is the length of one pattern multiplied by number of patterns which is given by frequency. Okay. So in one second f number of patterns uh, uh, wave patterns would be formed and therefore the total uh, distance of waves which is created in one second would be equal to lambda f. Now of course because the source is continuously producing uh, these, uh, these waves in one second my old wave would have to move this much. In one second my old, old wave would have to move this much for the new wave to take its place and therefore the speed of the wave has to be equal to lambda into f. So hopefully we have explained to you intuitively why this formula actually exists because this is important formula and you always always have to remember this. Thank you.